Town Center updates. Good afternoon and welcome back to midday. We had so much rainfall in the last 48 hours, especially in our northern parish. They had between um, half an inch to an inch of rainfall and as you move further south, uh, between two to three inches of rainfall and St. Landry Parish took the brunt of the rainfall. They had at least five inches of rainfall. So that will go into that drought monitor for next week. So hopefully we'll see a few improvements finally on that drought monitor. So as of now, cold front pushing through, but it is on the weak side. It won't change much just to changing winds and also uh, keeping us dry just for a couple of hours here but the, most of the rainfall is in the Gulf of Mexico that moved through our area last night and this will continue to shift more so towards the east but as of now we are dealing with more rain on the way coming up later into Saturday but we'll finally dry out coming up Sunday as we have another cold front that will completely push out the moisture and also those rain chances here in our area so we're expecting a pretty dry start to next week so still uh, moisture in the air here in the south, so that will fuel showers and thunderstorms through Saturday. But as of uh, a little bit before midnight Sunday, that will come to an end and keep us mostly dry for a Sunday, even through the start of next week. So rain chances uh, pretty low this afternoon, may have a few scattered showers and thunderstorms, but the best chance of rain is coming up tonight, upwards of 90 to 100 percent there. So showers and storms likely, but by Saturday to Sunday, that will have decrease and rain chances at zero percent through Monday and even so on through the end of next week. So temperatures pretty warm today in the 70s and even for the weekend, low 70s tomorrow, upper 60s by Sunday, mid 60s on Monday, 67 by Tuesday. So luckily we'll be a lot closer to average for next week. But as we take a temperature outlook for December 8th through the 14th, we're expecting above average temperatures for more most of the country here coming up. So we'll be a pretty warm middle of December. So that's December 8th through the 14th. Now for the next couple of hours, rain chances on the rise here later this evening into the nighttime hours and most of that rainfall occurring around midnight carries through Saturday morning, but those showers become spotty by the afternoon and evening hours, but by midnight Sunday completely dry out there, but we'll still have in cloudy skies coming up and also the first of December also means the first of meteorological winter that begins today through February. But that winter solstice, which is also the shortest day of the year, is December 21st. And that is coming up rather fast in about 20 days. Christmas Eve is in 23 days. Can you only imagine so fast here? Christmas Day in the 24 and then 2024 is in 31 days. So the year has been going by pretty fast. But as we take a look at the seven day forecast, once again, rain chances likely tonight into Saturday. Highs topping out in the 70s, upper 60s by Sunday, and we'll contend with temperatures in the 60s through the start of next week. But with that second cold front, Sunday into Monday, they'll completely push out those rain chances, keeping us dry and sunny for our Monday, even through Thursday of next week. But temperatures, not too many changes there. Warmest day is 67 on Tuesday, but those overnight temperatures back into the upper 30s and 40s once again, Ben. So it is a week. It is a, a festival weekend here in Alexandria. So what is what do we have to say about tonight? Honestly, uh, since they have the winter fit late in the afternoon, I think it starts at four. May want to have that rain gear with you. Might get wet. Yeah. So want to keep that handy. I want to be outside and start pouring down. Don't want to have that. <laughs> Thanks, Bree. Mm -hmm. And before we head to commercial.